Here we are at the final day in uh, Norway, Stavanger. The Randeberg Arena has come alive with the Norwegian crowd this afternoon on the edge of their seats. The qualifications have been off the hook this afternoon. You need to stand by and get prepared because shortly we're going to cross to the final rounds here in Norway at round two of the UCI BMX Supercross in 2012. Check it out live on www.bmxlive.tv. Okay, riders, random start. Riders ready, watch the game. Caroline Buchanan, what a fantastic race. You really got that sprint together at the right moment there, coming past Magali Potier in the finish line. Tell us about the race. Um, it was pretty crazy. I felt like I got out good. I just got balled up at the back of the first turn, and didn't panic and tried to come back. And it kind of reminded me of uh, the World Cup in Holland when I was behind Magali in the last turn. I had a feeling I might be able to get her and I can't believe it. Like I haven't felt this feeling since I won my first mountain bike world title, so I'm pretty over the moon. Okay, riders, random start. Riders ready, watch the gate. I didn't get the best start and had to sort of make a run from behind and managed to do that and caught Connor, but I mean, he's, he's awesome. He's won two in a row, won all the time trials and we'll uh, just go back to work now and uh, try to fix a few things and uh, it's so close. It's, it's point of a percent these days and, and that's what's hard. It's hard to take it. You can, it's over in 30 seconds and you've got to be perfect and that's what he is right now. So. I'll go back to work and try to get on that level for Holland. Yeah, you know, today was an awesome race. Sam's a really nice guy, one of my good friends, and an awesome competitor. You know, you know he's going to give 100% of everything he has every time. And I'm, I'm so tired right now. I was everything I had right there. And, you know, I wasn't even, well, I can't even stand. I wasn't even frustrated at the line if he would have passed me because I know that I gave it everything I had.